It's not making any sense I'm under your influence And now I'm falling down, 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 down Hi guys, welcome back. So I am so glad to see you guys. It has been... Whew, it has been a crazy six months for me, I'm telling you. And it's all kind of coming to an end. So finally I can take a deep breath. Now I got two kind of tiny Shop Miss A orders in. I want to share them with you guys because there are some good things in them, some exciting things. And of course, I'll need your yes or no on if we want to demo on these products or not. So let's go ahead and get into what I grabbed new from Shop Miss A and some other things. And ooh, I'm so excited. Let's go ahead and get into it. Alright, first off, probably the most exciting thing out of this haul is I got all four of the new Fly With Me Baked Eyeshadows. What are they calling them? Baked Eyeshadow Blush and Highlighters. So these are basically anything you want them to be, which most eyeshadow and face products can transition to be one another. You know, it really, unless it says it's not for the eyes, you can use it with wherever you want to. So these can be whatever you want, but I would probably most likely use them either as more of a highlight at the ends and then just eyeshadow because, I mean, maybe blush, but not with these two. You don't want green or blue blush. <laughs> maybe you do. <laughs> so let's go through these and take a look. This first one here is the one with the, um, it's got like a brown, red, yellow, green, and then a champagne. It is called Emerald Peacock, which is a beautiful color. I have seen a lot of these types of products go around in the high-end makeup realm, so I'm hoping that these will quality-wise be close, you know? So I'm really, fingers crossed, and I really need to know how these are. Now with baked things, you can use them dry or wet, and that's the best thing about them. Um, if they don't pack that much of a punch dry, just wet them a little bit with some setting spray or anything you want, really. And kabam, you'll have something that you can use as a liner if you wanted to. The next one, which is the bluish kind of, oh, this one's so beautiful to see in person, just to look at it. And I'm not even a blue eyeshadow girl, and I just want to stick my whole face in this. <laughs> this is called Blue Morpho. That is really cool. I mean, it's it's gorgeous. It really is gorgeous. So this is another exciting one. I'm really excited about this. Um, and I'm usually not into those types of colors. And then we have a more hot pink type of one that runs from a pale, hot, orangish, light orange to a champagne. This one's called Red Lacewing. I really love the names on these. They're getting better and better with these. This one, wow. I already know what look I want to do with that one. And then lastly is probably my favorite and something that I will use as a blush for sure. Um, Forest Queen, which is all like a mauve palette. I could use this all over my face all over my face. I see blush, highlighter, eyeshadow, eyeliner. I see so much in this palette. So I'm really excited about this one. Um, I Like I said, I love the names. I think these are so cool. This is a new aspect. Um, you're not seeing the same old, same old colors that they put out with their schemes. So I think they may be getting the message. This is very exciting. I love the Fly With Me crayon lip, like the lip crayons. I love those so much. So I'm very excited to try these out, but I wanna know if you guys wanna see me do that on camera. So let a girl know and then let's move on. The next thing I grabbed was one of OKI's new cutting boards. I already don't know if I like it. It was $1.33, so it's not $1.88, which is nice, but it came bent where I would normally hang it. So, and I cannot, it's like, looks like it's going to snap if I try to bend it back. It has um, a texture on the back, and then it's just flat. So, I'm sure it's fine as a cutting board, but I'm a wood cutting board girl, and this turned me off. I don't know. I don't know how much I like that, to be honest. The next thing that I grabbed just because I had to, I had to, um, the cell phone stands, the new cell phone stands they came out with. Let me open this up. Now I got mine in mint mostly because my phone case is green at the moment. These are a dollar. I believe there's a few different colors. I know that there's a pink. You just fold it like that and then you can set your phone in it 
and it like it holds it hold on I am today is not my day okay there and then you can just set it and you have a phone stand to watch shows and stuff with so if you don't want one of the fancy ones on Amazon that costs a little bit more a dollar and you got yourself one that is a folding chair okay it's cute it's cute the next thing that I picked up was a pair of yoga socks. Do I do yoga? No. Did I used to? Yes. I used to be very hardcore into yoga when I was younger and 118 pounds. Um, and I would like to get back in not to 118 pounds because um, I'm a grown woman. But I would like to get back to a nice place with yoga. So I grabbed a pair of the black. They do have different colors. These look and feel very comfy. They have a lot of grip on them. So I will be using them, trying them out, and letting you guys know if they are worth it. I love how they say yoga on the bottom. That's actually a pretty nice quality too. I'm 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 pretty stoked about that. How much were they? A dollar eighty-eight. So those were a dollar eighty-eight. Not bad at all. And then I grabbed two more of the foundation sticks. And let me tell you why. Because when we tried these out in my demo video, um, I didn't really care for these. But I will tell you that they lasted on my face incredible the whole day. It was insanity. Like, they, they really did last really good. I think that it's just I needed a better primer underneath it that was more moisturizing because it is a drier formula so what I did was I picked up darker colors because I saw on the site I picked up rich and light ivory which is really actually dark for me and then this is you know like who really dark I picked them up because I saw on the site that the pictures of people using these as bronzers and contour so I wanted to try that out as well. So I needed these two colors for that and we can try that out in the same video with the eyeshadows if wanted. The next thing I picked up was some exfoliating things that they just came out with. The new exfoliating bath gloves which seem kind of awesome. A dollar for pink. I think there might be different colors. Um, I'm not positive. They do feel good but they don't feel like they'll be that exfoliating so I'm not sure I have to try these out and see how they are when they're wet and then I also picked up the extra coarse exfoliating pumice bar this I don't know how to explain it it feels like a piece of styrofoam usually pumice bars um that I use or have are like a rock this is more like foam installation, if that makes sense. So I'm a little weirded out about it. I want to see if it works. It was $1.33. So we shall see. I like the shape and I like how big it is. So we're going to see. The next thing I grabbed was their nail clippers. Now these are acrylic. I'm, I'm going to take it out of the package. These are like acrylic nail clippers. I got mine in purple. I think that they're a dollar how much are you a dollar 55 because they're part of the paw paw collection and that's what i was excited about um they do come in different colors i have a metal one that i got from amazon this one is more plastic but it still essentially does the same thing so i wanted to try this out and see if this was just as good as the one that i got off of amazon to do my acrylics with because if i can get one that's dollar 55 versus four or five dollars I'm going with the dollar 55 <laughs> of course I picked up more sheet masks just the normal I am um, esfolio green tea gold mask you guys know the deal miss a sheet masks they're only a dollar I'm addicted to them it's very soothing it's the mom time for me <laughs> I also picked up plastic ear covers now what these are for is you put them around your ears when you're dyeing your hair so you do not get the dye on your hair these I was excited about because what I use because when I dye my hair I dye my hair brown my hair is brown I dye my hair because I have a lot of grays now which is insane I need to do it again soon um and that's why I picked these up was because I need to dye my hair again soon and what I use is petroleum jelly around my hairline and my ears and it does cause me to break out so I would rather use these are you kidding so these I think you get 10 covers for a dollar not bad at all especially since you don't really dye your hair too much unless you're a colorful person so I like that I like that a lot and then I went and picked up their silicone nail stamper I have one of these I just want to see how good this one is it's a dollar 
and it says you can do easy French tips with it and everything. It does seem exactly like the one I got off of Amazon, to be honest with you. So I'm, I'm hoping for the best there because the one I got off of Amazon was not a dollar. And then lastly, I got the nail polish corrector. I want to see if this works. So many of these have let me down in life from expensive to not. So this was a dollar and I really do want to see if it works. Although their demo for it didn't seem like it was working and then all of a sudden it cut and it was gone. So I'm like, <laughs> I don't know guys. <laughs> Okay, so that was everything that I've picked up so far. Please let me know what you guys think. Um, I will link everything I talked about and showed down below in the description box. Um, and let me know in the comments if you guys want to see another makeup tutorial slash get ready with me slash whatever the hell those are. I don't really know what to call them. I'm um, trying out some new methods and some new makeup. Let me know. Um, thank you so much for tuning in and watching my videos. I really do appreciate it, you guys. And I, of course, will see you guys in the next one.